I forgot to be romantic during the lockdown. I forgot how it works. So what I did is I googled how to be romantic and Google <laughs> gave me a lot of great tips. Google suggested to take a bath with the loved one. Is it, is it just me? If I take a bath with, with my loved one, you know, I mean, I am almost like five foot seven, you know, with another adult in a bathtub, how do you fit? I, mean, I, I have been in a bathtub with another person. It's, I have done that, you know, but when I was a child <laughs> with my sister, yeah, that's, now I am, I'm four times the size of that. And even that was tight, you see. And if you are in the same bath with someone, how, how do you, how do you, you can only really do it if you like to have another person's knee in your bottom, right? Because, because what do you do with your legs, right? Because do you put the legs in between the partner's legs or do you put it outside or do you go one by one or do you just let it hang over the bath? What you actually have some advice. That's great. <laughs> And the, and the thing is, when you take a bath with someone, do you take a bath before you take a bath? <laughs> right? Because you want to be clean as well. But if you take a bath and, and your, your, your loved one takes a bath and then you take a bath together, it's a lot of baths. <laughs> I'm not an environmentalist, but it's a lot. So I was like, okay, no, no bath. And also, also the, the images you see on Google, you know, you see always these, these lovely bubble baths. So I, I tried that yesterday. I ran myself above and I'm just like, I'm trying it out. You know how it looked like? It looked like that. <laughs> Where are the bubbles? <laughs> I have no, I use this, this Austrian bath thing, but it's, it's good for your back, but it's no bubbles. It's <laughs> <yeah>. <laughs> so I was thinking no bubble bath, no, no bath. It's not romantic for me. And then I Googled something else and they said something else. If you want to impress your, your loved one, make a romantic dinner. But I think dinner with, you know, if you want to have sex in the end of the evening and have dinner first, it doesn't work because you have to cook something that doesn't drop on your clothes and doesn't stick in between your teeth, right? <laughs> and it's really difficult because you can't eat any soup, anything with sauces, parsley, salads, you can't eat any of that. <laughs> and then I thought the only meal that you can have when you want to have sex after is actually just white wine. <laughs> and then the last suggestion google gave me the last suggestion was um do a full body massage for your loved one it's I, I i don't know a full body massage ending in a happy ending i don't think so because a full body a full body is a lot you know <laughs> it, is, it has like two legs and two arms and two hands and two feet and the head and the neck and two shoulders it's a lot <laughs> by the end your fingers hurt you don't want to have sex after <laughs> right? it's true and, and you can't stop in the middle and say like oh sorry could i could i just postpone and do your left calf in two weeks <laughs> you can't do that you have to go for it so my advice, if you look for some uh, romantic ideas, my advice is to take a shower, drink some white wine and have sex. <laughs>